Have you ever wondered about the earliest known ruling lineage in the Sin region, the Rai dynasty? This dynasty, reigning over Sin from approximately 489 to 632 CE, is a captivating tale of power, influence, and mystery. Its emergence is believed to be due to a power vacuum following the decline of Sasanian influence in the region. The Rai dynasty's story is primarily documented in the Chak Nama, a historical chronicle that serves as a window into this fascinating era. Yet, like a mirage shimmering in the desert, the dynasty's origins remain largely elusive. Attempts have been made to corroborate their existence through contemporary coin finds, yet such efforts remain speculative. The Rai dynasty, a complex tapestry of power and influence, remains a fascinating study in the annals of history. Their reign spanned 144 years, a testament to their resilience and adaptability. As we delve deeper, prepare to be intrigued by the tales of rulers like Rai Dawaji, Rai Sahiras Verse, Rai Sahasi I, and Rai Sahiras II. The Rai dynasty's reign, spanning 144 years, was marked by notable rulers like Rai Dawaji, Rai Sahiras I, Rai Sahasi Wust, and Rai Sahiras II. Each ruler left an indelible mark on the dynasty, navigating through a myriad of challenges while making significant contributions to their kingdom. Rai Duwaji, the founding father of the dynasty, set the stage for a lineage that would shape the history of Sindh. His reign was marked by a steady hand and a vision for a prosperous kingdom. Following Duwaji, Rai Sahiras Wai ascended to the throne. His reign was a testament to his leadership skills and strategic acumen. He navigated the kingdom through numerous obstacles, maintaining stability and prosperity in his realm. Then came Rai Sahasi I, a ruler known for his wisdom and diplomacy. His reign saw a period of peace and prosperity further solidifying the Rai dynasty's hold over Sindh. However, the most notable of the Rai kings was Rai Sahiras II. Renowned for his justice and wealth, Sahiras II was a beacon of fairness and prosperity. Yet his reign was not without its challenges. He faced a formidable opponent in the Sasanian king of Nimroz. Despite his best efforts, Rai Sahiras II met an untimely demise, leaving a void in the dynasty. Rai Sahasi II, the last of the Rai kings, took over the reigns in an era of socio-economic prosperity. However, his reign was marred by internal strife. His queen, Soman Devi, and his chamberlain Chak orchestrated a plot to usurp the throne. Despite the prosperity he ushered in, Rai Sahasi II's rule ended in a cloud of deceit and betrayal. In the face of deceit and military maneuvers Chak ascended to power, marking the end of the Rai dynasty and the beginning of the Brahmin dynasty. The Rai kings with their wisdom, courage, and vision left a legacy that continues to echo through the annals of history, reminding us of a time when they ruled over Sindh with distinction and honor. As we journey from the majestic Maurya Empire to the intriguing Rai dynasty, our thirst for knowledge remains unquenched. It is with deepest gratitude that I thank you for joining me on this incredible journey. Your unwavering support and dedication have been the cornerstone of Conspiranet's growth and success. As we stand on the precipice of a new adventure, I am filled with both excitement and anticipation. There are so many more stories to tell, so many more histories to uncover. Rest assured, we will continue to dive into a world that will enrich your life and expand your horizons. We will continue to explore the wonders of our universe together, learning, growing, and reveling in the mysteries of our past. And as we do, remember this. As long as we humans know that we're going to share the same future, we will survive. See you on the other side. With heartfelt thanks and anticipation, Bisaj Shelki at Conspira Net.